Computational fluid dynamics studies anticipate droplet trajectory and evaluate and confirm nozzle positions. Five. Reasons why turbine wash is required. In this video there are two section first is the theory of why we required to perform turbine water wash and second is the animation of turbine water wash process. 1. Performance and efficiency dropped. The trends in flow during compressor fouling are shown in figure. 1. The compressor inlet mass flow is observed to decrease, and this is due to the decrease in the compressor non-dimensional flow during fouling. Since the compressor inlet pressure and temperature remain constant in the simulation, any decrease in the compressor non-dimensional flow W1 square root T1 slash P1 results in a proportional decrease in compressor inlet mass flow, W1. Since the power loss due to compressor fouling is greater than the efficiency loss, the fuel flow decreases. The compressor exit temperature remain essentially constant during fouling, as shown in figure. 2. Two. Exhaust temperature spreads. What is an exhaust temperature spread, and why is it so important to monitor and take appropriate action when an exhaust temperature spread develops? An exhaust temperature spread refers to a high differential in readings between the thermocouples placed radially around the exhaust of a gas turbine. The worst exhaust temperature spreads occur when the hottest and coldest exhaust thermocouple readings are grouped very closely, adjacent. Most exhaust temperature spreads are the result of combustion section problems that can lead, very quickly in some cases, to premature turbine blade, bucket, failures. In other words, exhaust temperature spreads are indicative of combustion troubles that can lead to catastrophic failure. Figure 3, at 3600 rpm every turbine blade, bucket, passes each combustor 60 times each second, in the graphic above. Combustor number 2 has a lower hot gas temperature entering the first stage turbine nozzle. Three. Increase of T5 temperature. In gas turbine engine there be combustion chamber where air fuel mixture is burnt. It is the place where maximum temperature exists. So, there are temperature sensors at different places. T5 determines the temperature of the combustion chamber as temperature is very high there so measuring sensor is placed at a place slightly away from high temperature zone where there are temperature is bit lower than the formal that's why it's called lower T5. In event of compressor blade and turbine blade fouling, the air plus fuel mixture ratio is disturbing, mean that burning inside combustion chamber to be more in order to maintain the constant speed, then T5 will increase. Four. Increase of exhaust temperature. When compressor, rotor and stator blade, fouling or dirty, performance of compression ratio is dropped. The exhaust temperature control line, exhaust temperature versus compressor discharge pressure, is a horizontal line, isothermal limit which protects the exhaust system, at lower compressor discharge pressure. At some point, the line slopes down so that the exhaust temperature limit decreases as compressor discharge pressure increases, this part is the constant firing temperature line, which protects the first stage nozzles and buckets. Figure 5 shown the typical schedule of exhaust gas temperature, EGT, VS compressor discharge pressure, CDP, for a single shaft gas turbine. Five. Increase of fuel consumption. Increase of fuel consumption of gas turbine engine is due to air fuel mixture burnt is disturbing. This is related to increase of T5 determines the temperature of the combustion chamber. When the compressor blade and turbine blade dirty, the air flow rate drop then fuel to be mixture be more in order to achieve burning ratio to maintain constant speed of gas turbine. Animation on how gas turbine water wash or turbine wash process. 
Everywhere in the air there are particles, tiny particles generated by manufacturing, transportation and mother nature in the form of dust, pollen, salt and other contaminants. Large quantities of particles or contaminated air make it all the way to the compressor section of a gas turbine. These deposits decrease the airflow and overall performance and efficiency. This raises fuel consumption and global warming pollutants. Keeping the compressor section clean is critical. A clean compressor has shown to reduce fuel consumption, significantly contribute to environmental compliance programs, reduce operational costs, and extend maintenance intervals. The development of the Wood Group GTS highly atomized direct injection system has allowed compressor cleaning to achieve a giant step forward in providing cost-effective and environmentally adapted methods. The system uses deionized water only and eliminates the need for hazardous chemicals. Wood Group GTS patented eco valve wash systems include 3D modeling of inlet and nozzle positioning. Computational fluid dynamics studies anticipate droplet trajectory and evaluate and confirm nozzle positions. Running a daily online compressor wash schedule will increase average power output and heat rate by minimizing the daily degradation due to compressor fouling. Upon increasing the gas turbine efficiency, exhausts will be cleaner and pollution will be reduced. Wood Group GTS Experience totals more than 20 million hours of gas turbine running time. The installation and operation is very simple and well received by our customers. The end result of our advanced compressor water wash technology is a more efficient power plant and a cleaner environment. Thank you for watching this video. If you have other theory on the gas turbine water wash or any suggestions please give some comments down below. If you think this video meaningful for you, please liked share and do subscribe this channel so more video will produce. Thank you.